back to my YouTube channel. My name is Crystal and I am so excited because for today's video, I will be taking you guys through a what I spend in a week living in San Diego, California as a 23 year old who works in tech. My current occupation or my current title is an IT associate and I'm in a rotation program right now, but I do share an apartment with my boyfriend and a roommate. We do live in a two bed, two bath, and I'll take you guys through what my fixed costs are at the end of this video. But I wanted to make this video because I find these to be super interesting. I love learning how people spend their money, their spending habits, and you know what it costs to buy certain things in the city that they're living in. So you know I wanted to do that because I feel like it's fun and it could be interesting or informative for anyone who wants to move to San Diego or who is thinking about moving on their own. And you know, obviously this goes without saying, not every week is the same. Some weeks I spend more, some weeks I spend less. I try to be very frugal, but I do like to enjoy my money as well. So if you wanna learn more about you know my payday routine, how I budget, I have a video linked up here. So we don't have to spend time this video talking about it. I hope you guys enjoy the video and we'll get started with some day. Happy Sunday. We are here at the Padres game. Padres versus Dodgers. Yeah. Game four. Game four. We came at the last inning and spent... <laughs> hey, we're here for the vibes. Like 30 something dollars to be here? Yeah, exactly. Here for the vibes, vibes. exactly. <laughs> Good, you guys so today is Monday and I really didn't do too much today I actually had to wake up at 5 30 a.m. but after work I stayed home all day today and I ate meals that I bought like a few weeks ago so technically I'm counting it as part of like this week's what I've spent but I am buying a ticket to Tulum right now because my friends and I are going in October um, and they already bought their tickets so I was like I should probably buy that before the price is go up actually flying out of tijuana because tj is only like 20 minutes away from us and it's cheaper just to fly out of tijuana from mexico to mexico so i spent today 206 dollars for our <laughs> for my flight to tulum in october so if anyone has any recommendations please let me know you guys happy tuesday and i know yesterday i said i don't normally buy plane tickets but today we bought another one to hawaii and so that came out to 171.56 i also ate one of our simply g meals today and it comes out to four dollars a meal so i'll just say i paid four dollars for my lunch today and then the last thing i did today is i went to costera uh joined and i it's actually our month anniversary, so we've been together for four months, four months, four years and three months. So we decided to celebrate because his mom actually bought us a gift card to a really awesome restaurant here in San Diego at Costera. Um, and we haven't used it yet, so we had some free time today. And so we went out and got some really delicious food. But here's a total, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. What is up you guys? Happy Wednesday. I did spend money today. Lynn was in the state area, so he got me blenders. I got the peanut butter builder. He hasn't charged me yet, but I think it's probably around like six or seven dollars. And then at five, I am going to my lash appointment with my girl Mel. You guys have heard me talk about her before. I love her so much, and I'm just getting a fill for a hybrid. I get fills every two weeks or so, and it normally comes around, it comes to $65. So I want to budget like 65, 70. But yeah, I think that's everything that I'm gonna spend today. Also, shout out to our friend James. He brought us adobo that he made, and that shit was chef's kiss it was so good and i ate that for lunch but for dinner i think i still have some leftover frozen from trader joe's that i bought a few weeks ago so i'm just gonna eat that for dinner hi friends happy thursday you would never guess what i did today all i did today was work but I did go to 7-Eleven because I was really craving chips and so we ended up getting Ben & Jerry's ice cream and salt and vinegar chips. I think actually salt and vinegar is for the most elite taste buds. So if you don't like it, you may want to think about 
widening your taste palette. Thank, Thank you. you. We went to 7-Eleven and right now we're getting ready because we are going out to celebrate our friends Josh's birthday. So we won't be here this weekend, um, but we are getting Korean barbecue at Olay in Convoy. If you've never been to Convoy in San Diego, 20 out of 10 would recommend to check it out. They have some of the best Asian food. And I think we're gonna hit up Pacific Beach afterwards to go to a bar. We'll see if I spend anything if I go out tonight. And happy Friday! And just like that, we are at the end of the week. But we are leaving to the Bay tonight to basically be in the Bay Area for a day. We're actually going to a wedding tomorrow, so we leave tonight at 9. So Julian right now is dropping off Harlow at the Doggy Hotel. So we're going to have to pay for that when we come back. And Julian and I normally split the cost of taking Harlow to the Dog Hotel. So I want to say it's going to probably come around like $70 each for basically two nights. Did I pay for anything else? I don't think I... I oh, actually, I did. I got Lexi Nails. Hold on. You guys don't know, I'm a big press on girl, press on nail girl. I love it. I've used Luxy, Static Nails, Glamnetic Nails, Kiss, obviously, and Finger Suit. I pretty much like all of them besides Finger Suit. They already have like the sticky adhesive on the nail, so you just peel off like the protective layer and you place it. And I don't necessarily like the stick on option, I prefer like nail glue because it sticks on better. Like I said, I did buy Press On Nails from Luxie and that came out to $57.93. Um, I did get a discount code, so that was minus $6. Shipping was free. So it comes to around like, like $14 per nail set. So I did buy that today. These are the ones that I got and they're so cute. We are gonna go head to the airport pretty soon. We're probably gonna have to pay for an Uber and then I'll probably get food tonight unless I can hold it till we land in Oakland. Yeah, so I think I'm probably gonna spend money on food and then Uber. I'll list everything right here. So we have reached the end of this video and now is the time from the moment of truth. Um, which I'm nervous for, but at the same time, I'm like, this money's already spent, it's gone. Let's not hang our heads over it. It is what it is. At least that's what I'm telling myself. So for Sunday, we went to the Padres game. I got that Michelada, which I don't know if you guys noticed, but it was green. And when I paid for it, I thought like it was like a variation, like plus $5 if you wanted like this cucumber version of it but that's all they had and i was like whatever i'll drink it it was the padres game and then we went to the story house after where i got a lot of food so the total for sunday came out to 84 dollars 83 monday is when i bought the tulum tickets and that was the only thing i bought for the day that was 206 dollars tuesday we bought our ticket to maui i had my simply g meal or my meal prep that we get every month um, and then we went to costera that came out to $202.56. On Wednesday, I just got a smoothie and my lash fill. That was $82. Thursday, we spent pretty much all our money on food for my friend's birthday. We went to Korean barbecue. And then we went to Pacific Beach afterwards. I ended up getting Dave's hot chicken because I had the drunchies. But that came out to $67.10. Friday, we took Carla to the dog hotel because we were leaving to the Bay Area to go to a wedding. Um, and then I also got nails that day, our Lyft and Taco Bell. That was $147.20. And then on Saturday was the day of the wedding. I didn't get any clips of the wedding, but I did get clips of what I spent my money on, which was just Jamba Juice. And that was $10.38. For the total cost of everything without the flights, because like I mentioned, it's not normal for me to buy plane tickets all the time. So without the flights, the total cost is $422.51, which is pretty good for my weekly spending. And I would say normally or roughly what I would spend every week. But with the flights, the total cost is $800.07.
$800. Only $200 under $1,000, which is kind of crazy to me, but it is what it is. I will say I do have the Southwest credit card, so that kind of helps me a lot because I do rack up points. And because for my Hawaii flight, I actually got it at a cheaper price because I had flight credit, which is something that they offer. So I would definitely recommend the Southwest credit card. This isn't sponsored. I'm just letting you guys know that I do have a travel credit card with Southwest. It's the Rapids Reward card. And if you're interested, I'll leave a link below if you wanna learn more about the different travel cards that Southwest has. So yeah, that's all my variable costs for this week. Now for the cost of living in San Diego, we do live in a two bedroom, two bathroom apartment. Me and Julian share one room and then we have our roommate Rory who's in the other bedroom. And we live in a 1,014 square foot apartment. And for my portion of the rent, I pay $314.20. And then for water, trash, gas, electric, Wi-Fi, um, I took the average of three months. And so for water and trash, I pay $10 on average. Gas and electric, $11.50 on average. Wi-Fi, $6.11 per week on average. So it's not too bad at all. So my total fixed cost is $341.81. Now my grand total, on the other hand, for the entire week, drum roll please, Total cost is $1,141.88. That is what I spent this past week, which is kind of ridiculous. But honestly, for me, I do budget. As I mentioned, if you guys are interested in learning how I manage my money, I do have a link to that video. And I do want to reiterate that this is just a small snapshot of my life not every week is like this some days i spend more some days i spend less it just varies but i hope you guys find this video interesting if you have any questions let me know in the comments below if you guys are curious or anything but yeah please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video bye